Hey guys, what's up? My name is Jim. Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you guys my account. You guys might not believe me, but I spent $25 uh, in total on COD points. I'll tell you the trick what I did. So, if you guys don't know, um, Task 1 for... Um, Task 141 event is live. It's still here. Um, you guys can check out my other video, um, saying how I got this, um, Stealth Ghost. Or if it doesn't work, if you already did it doesn't work, I tell you in the last video what you should do. So, my score streaks. I do have all the score streaks because I do all the challenges. Um, oh, so, first off, Let's start with loadout. I I only have eight. Um, I have eight primary legendary weapons. They're all upgraded. My favorite one has to be M4 CQB because yeah, I love the M4 and this is by far one of the best ones because it has a high cosmetic. Probably black gold M4 might be better, but I like this one. So we got AK47 tank. Yeah, you got this is for free. You this is free. But you gotta go through hell to get this. And it wasn't pleasant. It was hard. Because Call of Duty Mobile has to start removing trip mines and all that. And start nerfing guns. So you get this by rank matches. Royal Quit Royal EBR Chris uh, M21 Royal Crimson. I would say it's an M14 probably. Um This is a twenty thousand credit gun, which I saved up. Then, I actually like it. It's fully upgraded. You can use this as a rifle if you want primary because it has a tactical scope. This has pretty good damage. I'd say it's a two hit, three hit kill, one hit shot. I think it's actually a pretty good gun. <laughs> I have no information. So I just finished this one in the battle pass yesterday. I don't. This is my. This has to be my least favorite. It's kind of ugly, but whatever. It's a legendary gun. I'll take it. And I believe that the AKS, I know it's called the RUS, but still AKS to me, I think it's nerfed because the gun sucks. So, I do use this primarily, but I used to use this. This is my first ever legendary gun, the AK-47 Red Action. The reason why I like this one better because of the iron sights. So, this one's very beautiful. It's red. You get it at the end of Battle Pass. Um, the OG Battle Pass. So, I got this one. I was pretty excited. So, this one's in Season 2 Battle Pass. Um, Season 4, which is current. Um, Season 3, which is the last, which was the uh, last, I mean, no, not the last one, but this was the previous one. Um, Top 25 Geometry, I can't, okay, so, this one's a, a beautiful skin, too. I see a lot of people running around with this gun skin because, um, remember, only 50, um, only 50 tiers, and the Battle Pass is under $5, I mean, under $10, probably like $6, so, M4 LMG Black Gold, I also saved up for this, um, this is a 20,000 crate gun. Uh, I mean, credit gun. It's actually a pretty beautiful gun. It has gold. I'd say it's worth it. And last but not least, Royal Crimson. This is my lat. This is a. Uh... I just bought this one today. This is a new twenty thousand credit gun. What I recommend is don't buy other credit um stuff. Probably like watch all the videos every day in order to get the credits. So ten day. So, and the battle passes and the events, always complete those so you can get more credits. So, I was saved up for this one, too. I like I like how the skin looks a lot. I hadn't tried it out. So, we got Mardi Gras, um, PDW. So, we got um, Rare's one right here. I don't know why is it called Rare. This is one of my favorite skins, too. It, it As you guys don't know... This skin moves, but back then it moved pretty smooth, but now it's, like, rough when it moves. As you guys can see that, which is probably my internet. So, we have this right here. We have some weapon skins. I remembered using this all the time. This is my favorite. 
because okay, as Call of Duty Ghost, I'll tell you what Call of Duties I played throughout my whole life. I'll tell you what Call of Duties I love, hate, and mediocre ones. So here we are. We have these. This is one of my favorite LK24 skins. Um, it has gold and all that. I feel like this might. This looks like a legendary, but. Um, there's barely a cosmetic, but there's gold every, but there's gold. So we're done with the rare, oh, Locust, um, everybody has this one. Um, and I also have, I see our one, Meteors. This is a free-to-play gun, too. This is a free-to-play gun, too, so. It's not, it's hard to get this one, but as long as you're good or a freaking noob and you try hard at ranked matches, you'll be okay. So, here goes my less sexy ones, which is the ugly ones. I say this one's actually a beautiful skin. I'm not going to lie. This one is also, too. I like Neon Tiger a lot, too. Neon Tiger is actually pretty cool. St. Patrick's Day is actually pretty cool, too, because, as you don't know, the ones that I hate has to be Gritty and Football, um, Hearts, Red Triangles, I don't really like. But, um, still a lot more. But my favorite purple skins have to be Meteors. Meteors is actually pretty cool. Imagine they made a legendary where it's all galaxy and there's meteors flying everywhere. That would be pretty dope. I like the melon ones. Jack Frost is pretty ugly. I like the Neon Tiger. Those are my three favorites. Oh, Holiday Ribbons, not that bad. And here's Common Guns. So we're done with that. Time to go look at my secondaries. So we have color spectrum. This is in Battle Pass, the right now one. I recommend this. I love this knife a lot. This one you gotta get it in zombies, but it's a. I got it in my first try in, in zombies. Um, I got pretty lucky. This one is in Battle Pass three. Uh. A revolver, snub nose, probably like a uh, 44. No, I don't think so. Because I remember there's gun in Black Ops. So we got the knives. My favorite knife is this one. But my favorite um, knife, like a blah blah, like a rare one, is this one. Because it has Call of Duty Ghost. I say Meteor's knife is not that bad. I think it's pretty, um, yeah, it's good. Not that bad. So, my skins, they're all right here. I really want to throw away Urban Tracker. I freaking hate her a lot. Um, I really want to throw away that one, too. So not that bad. So, my favorites are Ghost and Ghost. Don't ask. And this, and Alex Mason. Yeah, these are my three ones that I like. But I like Ghost the most. So we got the Phantom. I'll tell you, they're all from the Battle Pass, the Legendaries. So, Battle Pass 1, OG. Um, Battle Pass 2, Battle Pass 2, Battle Pass 3, Battle Pass 3, Battle Pass 4, and Battle Pass 4. Now, the Battle Passes have, like, 50 tiers. You'll get two Legendaries. In total, four Legendaries. Because you get two Legendary skins. Um, and two legendary weapons. My specialist, I always do, I always tell you, I always do the challenges. I don't want to miss out. I don't want to keep on spending money. So, I'll tell you the trick. You guys might think, be, oh, this is my favorite grenade skin. I know, I'm always starting, changing subjects. I don't know why. So, I'll tell you the, so, you guys might not believe this is a $25 account. You guys, yeah, you guys might believe it. Yeah, yeah, this is a $25 account. But if some of you guys think that this is a $100 account, I'm going to stop you right there. So here's my trick. Just buy $10 worth of COD points. Then keep on doing battle pass. Don't spend it on, don't spend your um, um, COD points on anything. Just battle pass. Because remember... If you're going to spend your COD points, don't spend it on crates because those are rigged. And extra skins, nah, don't get them. Just get the battle passes. They're worth your money. 
I always recycle my battle passes, my battle pass credits, I mean, card points, I always recycle them. So just finish the battle pass, then you'll get your money back. Then we got to zombies, no, it's the same thing. Battle Royale, so here's my wingsuit, it's my favorite OG, um, Call of Duty Ghosts. I don't get it, why do they bundle up? Ghost with Call of Duty Ghosts. Co Ghost was never in Call of Duty Ghosts. Where he probably is, I don't know. But I did finish the game. So, my call. So the first time when I played Call of Duty was I was like nine years old. No, probably like I was like six years old, just only one time. I used to talk crap about Call of Duty because I was like that little naive because my mom tells me, hey, don't play Call of Duty, it's rated M. And we started mass hatred on it because we couldn't play it. We were so naive. So when my uncle let us like play just one match in Black Ops, me and Jeremiah 1v1. So we sucked. I always keep on jumping off. I don't know why. Then when I was nine years old, my cousin had Modern Warfare 3 on PS3. So we tried it. I asked my mom's permission. Then we sucked at the game. Like, like I was like, what does this mean? Aim? So, yeah. I sucked, usually. Then I uh, tried um, Advanced Warfare. I started to like it. Modern Warfare 2. Black Ops. Then when I finally got a PS3, we had a uh, Black Ops 2 and uh, Ghosts on it, and we fell in love with Black Ops 2. They give you a lot of things in the game, and and then I started to play um. Then I started to play um Advanced Warfare, Black Ops, Black Ops 2. Um, I'm gonna tell you. All my uh, Call of Duties I played throughout. You know, say what I like, what I think was mediocre, which one do I hate? So I pl so I played um, Modern Warfare Remastered, but this is like one of the you guys might be thinking, bro. This was a later Call of Duty, but it's still Modern Warfare One. So I'm just gonna put that as like, but I never played that first. I'm just gonna go throughout the dates, but. I know it's Modern Warfare Remastered. That one's like 2016, but... Um, Modern Warfare was in 2007. Still same game. So Modern Warfare Remastered. I did play Modern Warfare once. The... The 2007. So Modern Warfare. Um, Call of Duty World at War. I freaking loved Call of Duty World at War. Um, Call of Duty... Modern Warfare 2, Black Ops, um, Modern Warfare 3, Black Ops 2, what's after Black Ops 2, um, Ghosts, Advanced Warfare, what's after, Black Ops 3, Black Ops 3 was pretty mediocre, um, Infinite Warfare, I loved the Infinite Warfare, not gonna lie, um, Modern Warfare Remastered, I freaking loved Modern Warfare Remastered. Um, and then I tried out, um, Black Ops 4. Black Ops 4 was freaking trash. I hated it. Then the last Call of Duty I played was a Modern Warfare. I loved the Modern Warfare, um, which is a new one. The new Modern Warfare. I loved it. I liked it a lot. I have, like, six gold skins in the game. Okay, so, the ones that were my favorite... Were Modern Warfare 20, 2019, Modern Warfare Remastered, um, Infinite Warfare, um, Modern Warfare 2, Black Ops. I did like Black Ops 2. That one's a good one. And World at War. I think I said World at War already. World at War was a good one. I loved it. And what else? And Ghosts. So... You guys might be thinking, why the hell do you pick, do you like the worst ones? I don't think Ghost or Infinite Warfare is bad. I don't think they're bad. 
But I think freaking Black Ops 4 is the worst. I hate it. Then I'll tell you the ones that I hated. Black Ops 4. Black Ops 4 is trash. I hated it a lot. Because it, it doesn't even feel like Call of Duty. You guys might be thinking BS, bro. Freaking Infinite Warfare. Well, yeah. At least Infinite Warfare is fair because you can still self-heal. They give you stuff. They, at least it has a campaign. And they don't freaking put out a bunch of microtransactions. Black Ops 4, they put out a bunch of microtransactions. Um, There's no campaign. You have to self-heal. And they just replace the battle, the campaign for just freaking Blackout. The game was trash. I hated it a lot. And also, I never tried World War II, but that game, it just freaking offended me a lot because... What they at what they put in there? They it was pretty hin historically inaccurate. I didn't like it, which pretty offense offensive. But Black Ops F Black Ops Two is pretty mediocre. So yeah, guys, it's my account and it's the Call of Duties I played. I know you guys might not care when I talk about the Call of Duties. I do stutter a lot. I don't know why. So yeah, that is my account.